Hi guys, Tommy here. In this video, which will probably be another short video, um, about seeing the funny side in things in stressful situations or situations where others might find um, the situation uncomfortable, unsettling, frustrating or stressful. And this is a good um, psychological technique that some people do naturally um, and I've tried to implement over the last year or so when I was thinking about it but kind of seeing seeing the humor in things that in a shitty situation basically an example or kind of two examples of these two uh, these two girls that I've met in my in my life who have, have done this really well um, they reminded me of each other and I think this was probably one of the re reasons why it's two quite interesting people actually and uh, one thing they did really well that I um, I've kind of noticed later on was if in like a, a serious situation like that people might, might start to be getting kind of aggravated and um, it, it can start to get maybe a bit stressful or it's maybe like supposed to be a bit serious they'd always find it they'd be like the first person to find it funny and the first example um, I would used to find it maybe when one of these people did it, like the first person I met, I'd all, maybe sometimes if I was a bit kind of stressed or frustrated, I'd maybe be a bit annoyed that I was just kind of laughing at something that I thought was a bit serious. But um, only later on kind of do I see the kind of humour in it. And um, it kind of takes, it takes the seriousness out of the situation. And I guess it's a lesson as well to not take yourself too seriously and kind of find the humour in yourself. Um, not to say like, take yourself completely unseriously as a joke but to kind of take um a really heightened level of seriousness away from yourself not take yourself too seriously and um you know seeing the humor in life and seeing the funny side of things and this is actually something that i think is actually a very emotionally intelligent thing to do because there is that saying you either laugh or cry about it and i think that's um I think that's true to an extent. Um, obviously, there's you're going to still experience pain and things. You're going to experience suffering in life. In life, everyone experiences this. But in a situation that's quite stressful, um, and you may be beginning to be frustrated, one example I've thought of: maybe you're in traffic and you've been in traffic for ages. You know, it's, it seems like it's not going your way, and you know, it's, it's, it's uncomfortable, it's a shitty situation. But you actually kind of, you know, you're trying to get home, but you, you actually kind of, you can feel yourself getting worked up at it, maybe you kind of are, but you actually take a step back and just kind of smile to yourself and kind of laugh, like there's nothing you can do about it. And you kind of see this this funny side in, in this situation. And it's, it's gonna be a lot better for you, for your, you know, your mental health, basically. Um, and your body's going to react to that and because you're responding in a, in a joyful way because in a situation like that is out of your control we know it's a shit situation no one wants to be in traffic but um you can kind of see that see the funny side in it um because it might be so bad and you, yeah you see the humor in it and you basically react in a positive way instead of a negative way yeah it reminds me of a like a, a stoic technique I, i've read a little bit on stoicism i don't think i've never seen this technique anywhere but it, it, it seems like a because i have a lot of psychological techniques it seems it seems like a psychological technique a type of thing that they'd use i don't think they haven't seen them mention this example but um it's definitely like a stoic like thing to do so ancient ancient greek philosophy but yeah it reminds me of that a little bit as well but yeah Try not to take yourself too seriously and, and see the, see the humour in things, even if it does seem shit.